Hey family, have you ever been fearful or overwhelmed with what the future may hold? Well, I know I have. My name is Rodney and today I'm gonna to talk about praying for protection. So short story, in the book of Exodus chapters 12, there's a very interesting story about the Lord and how he protects his people. As we know, the Israelites are God's chosen people, so they were promised to always be protected. There was great evil in the city at this time, and death was coming to take so many lives. However, God in all of his wisdom instructed the Israelites to go and sacrifice a lamb and smear blood on the doorpost. And if they do this, he said that death would pass over. So the Israelites followed those instructions and they were protected. I get so excited when I read this story because when Jesus died on the cross, not only was it a sacrifice for our sins, but it was a sacrifice for our protection. That's something to get excited about. The Bible says in this verse, Isaiah 54 and 17, no weapon formed against you shall prosper and every tongue that rises up against you in judgment, you shall condemn. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord, and their righteousness is from me, says the Lord. I love it also in the NIV. It's a little more broken down. It says, no weapon formed against you will prevail, and you will refute every tongue that accuses you. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord, and this is their vindication from me, declares the Lord. Family, we are covered by the blood of Jesus meaning we are protected by our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. It is our responsibility to pray and declare truth over our lives. We are healed, we are delivered, we are set free, we are safe from all harm, and we have no reason to fear. 2 Timothy 1 and 7 says, For God hath not given us the spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. So when fear tries to creep into your life, I want you to pull that scripture up. God has not given me the spirit of fear, but he's promised me peace. He's promised me protection. He's promised me long life. So I'm gonna pray this prayer over your life. We're gonna pray it together. Father, I thank you right now for every individual watching this video. God, we thank you that you're the God that fights for us. You go before us. Before we get to the battle, before we get to that mountain, you are already there working it out. It's already done. So Father, we pray that you would help us to have the faith to trust in you more. Help us to have the faith to declare victory before we see it. Help us to have the faith to declare that we have overcome by your blood. We are protected no matter what we see, no matter what we feel. We will not accept defeat. We will not accept oppression. We will not accept anything that does not line up with your word. So Father, we give you praise. We give you glory in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. You all have a blessed day.